And here's how Vietnam will line up. Well, in this shape, unless their wing-backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Played into the centre. Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, good accuracy, and enough power to beat the keeper. That's an excellent goal. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Keeping the ball moving. Is she going to score? And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes! Incredible stuff! Well, as you can see, it's a decent strike, but I'm not sure about the keeper here. She can't be beaten inside that near post. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Victoria Pelova. Surely! Oh, good save. Well, they're going for the short one. Played into the box. And they produce the arrears. You never know. They still believe in themselves. Well, here's the replay, and it's a well-worked corner. They go short, change the angle, and then put the ball into the box. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. whistle here well it's a little blot on the copybook we have to say that but nevertheless despite the defeat we will be seeing them in the round of 16 Stuart well it wasn't a great performance not a great result but they're through now they can focus on the round of 16 where they will need to play that little bit better that's for sure